you can't help but uh, also enjoy the spectacular. I'm thinking of setting up a, a, a channel for scratch and smell. So, what's the recipe today, Natapon? Greek yogurt, meal, nampung, manao. Okay. Banana. Well, after that, I pour and mix that, uh, that milk, homemade Greek yogurt, honey, and squeezing uh, a lemon. I think it's the love as well that she puts into it. There's a spoonful of love she puts into it. I can see the outline of the mountain today. Uh, the sky is clearing slowly. There's a blue tinge to it. So the smoke is uh, thankfully moving on. We had some heavyish winds uh, in gusts now and again yesterday. So I was rather hopeful that might blow it all through, but it's lingering a bit. There's a lovely crane. Oh, there's a crane circling above, a white. No, revise that. It's an open-billed stork. Beautiful big bird just gliding round swooping over this field at the back. He's coming around again now. He might be landing. Yeah, he's on, he's on finals. No, he's in a holding pattern. He's going around again. He's dumping fuel, I think. There's two of them now. Wow. Yeah, they're definitely coming in. Well, um, unfortunately those storks didn't um, uh, come down. Uh, but uh, I've been joined now by uh, Nam Pung. She's the one that's sort of back up in the air and tail all fluffed out because of the other three getting, uh, getting feisty with her. Well, she's a lovely girl. Well, hello there. Uh, this week, I think it's uh, day 16. I have got to apologise. I think I miscounted uh, last time I spoke to you. Uh, I don't know about you, but uh, I've lost track of all time. What day is it? I think it's Sunday. <laughs> Could be. I hope so. Anyway, I think it's Sunday. Yeah, it's Sunday. Um, anyway, I think it's day 16 as well. And. Uh, I want to welcome you to this channel. If you've just uh, found it, uh, please consider subscribing. Uh, I really want to say thank you to the new subscribers I've had this last uh, uh, week. Um, it's growing. Thank you very much. I appreciate uh, you taking the trouble to click and also to comment. I appreciate all the feedback I can get. Uh, I'm glad I'm keeping some people entertained around the planet. Uh, we need it in this, uh, in this time. I've been out and about this week uh, a couple of times uh, on routine domestic things. Um, still not um, ha happy at uh, looking at the sky, so I've not flown at all. I've not been out, uh, you know, very far. I've just been over to Camptian, a flower market. Uh, it's the other side of Chiang Mai. Uh, it's a place where you can buy anything for your garden. Whilst I was over there, I thought I'd uh, go and see Ken. All right. Well. I've come here today to give Ken uh, this canon that uh, Pitai makes and uh, when he left a comment on the video I thought how can I resist but take him some, it's delicious. So uh, I've come to see Ken, we've kept our distance, we've had a nice little chat and uh, I'm going to go my way, he's going to go his way and uh, we're not going to touch, we're not going to shake hands or get anywhere near each other and because we're wearing masks we're being sensible. And if you're not wearing a mask and you're in public anywhere in the world, you're not being sensible. So please, from Ken and I, wear a mask, stay safe, stay healthy. Now you're probably wondering why... Hello. 
and you're probably wondering why I've got this stuck up my nose. These are wonderful little aids we can buy here in Thailand at 7-Eleven. Uh, uh, great for relieving a stuffy head. And uh, you can buy them in slightly different flavours. Chiang Mai Baker Mart, that's where I am. And I love it here because the little guy here stands at the side of the road uh, checking that uh, there's a place for you if you want to park and directing the traffic. Uh, so you can park on the forecourt and when you pull out you don't uh, have an accident. Well, I've come to Camptian. Uh, it's a, like a garden market. It's uh, flowers and uh, plants and everything to do with uh, e everything to do with uh, plants. This guy here, I met him 15 years ago. Sip happy gone. There, one jump my day. me falang jump my day. My ben lai. There, Sorry, full press angry. Speaking English, um, Camtian is uh, a wonderful place. You can come around here and spend a whole day walking around. You see these beautiful plants uh, that you want in your garden, and you get them home and you don't have any water. Big issue. See the last video, uh, and you see all this colour here um, that uh, is it's, it's so wonderful. It's behind Tesco on the super highway in uh, in Chiang Mai, and you can come here seven days a week. Uh, and Feast your eyes on all this colour. The moisture in the air. Beautiful. Lovely. It's even got cactus in bloom. Blaze of colour. Absolutely beautiful. This is open 365 days of a year. Um, I've never known it to close. And you can buy at uh, various times of the year, obviously in season plants, uh, different colors at different times of the year. Uh, it's, it's an absolutely wonderful place to come and visit. But, you know, you cannot help but uh, also enjoy the spectacular. I'm thinking of setting up a, a, a channel for scratch and smell. Oh, lovely. That's really nice. Mmm, really nice, beautiful. But here's the thing, with a mask I can't smell a thing. So I know my mask is really doing well. I can smell it now. Well, I've got to say these, uh, these orchids are absolutely gorgeous. The colours, the detail in the bloom, they're all real, they're not, they're not plastic, they're real orchids. It just feels a shame there's nobody's buying them. Well, there's nobody here. But to be on display like this, absolutely beautiful. We have some wonderful outlets of uh, uh, orchids here in, uh, in the north of Thailand. Um, I think you'll remember in an earlier video, I, I, I went to a place over the back of Doyntonon where there was a, uh, a study center for them. I should think at this time of year, that's really well in bloom. Um, so, it's not open because it's a national park area and all national parks in Thailand are closed. So unfortunately we can't go and visit that. Well, I know giraffes have got long necks, but these are really long. Wow! I love cactus. Uh, they're such elegant, um, some beautiful little plants. Um, they're mysterious. I think that, that, that's the word. They're, 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 they're strange and there's a beauty in it. Absolutely gorgeous. I mean, some of these plants here are stunning. I asked the price of one uh, a couple of years ago and uh, it blew me away. Hello. <laughs> Well, I've not had to negotiate a price, it's a standard price, uh, three for a hundred baht. Um, and uh, the lady puts them in a plastic bag. I know, it's just going to keep them in. But the, the lady puts them in your back of your truck as well and she'll load it all up. And uh, they're friendly as well. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. Ready, Cap? 
so uh, we've now got uh, some buckets we need for the garden and also I wanted some more soil because we're going to pot on some stuff in the garden this week. If Noi, you're watching this, uh, we miss you very much. Uh, we saw you a couple of months ago when we went to see the garden uh, uh, of Mali uh, out in uh, the Mewang Valley. Check out this, uh, which side is it now? It's this side. Uh, check out this video uh, that uh, I made when we went to uh, a coffee shop. Uh, they uh, had lots of mallet uh, in the garden there. I'm finished at uh, Camptian now. I'm going to go and pick up lunch. Uh, you remember in a previous video uh, I made a reference to uh, Shui Vegan, uh, the vegetarian cafe. Uh, I called them up earlier today. Uh, they do have grab taxi, uh, grab uh, food, uh, come and pick it up and deliver it to your house. But I thought, go and say hello and uh, pick it up as I'm over here anyway. Hello, Sawadee Kaab. Sawadee Kaab. Hello. Hello. There is the money, thank you, yeah. for my cab. This one, just wait a moment. Thank you, for my cab. This week on television, it's been uh, fascinating. Uh, morning television. Uh, in, it's the same around the world, you know, the same sort of format you get in many countries whereby three or four people sit behind a desk and chat, chat, chat about what's happening in their life. Well, this is another reason I love Thailand. Seriously, I really love Thailand. This is messaging. Um, as you can see, these uh, people are on morning um, time television. Uh, they are all wearing masks. They don't feel ashamed. Normally, they are, uh, in, in, in uh, other times, they are very happy to display how beautiful they look. They're quite happy to show uh, their, their skins uh, and, and their face looking absolutely beautiful. I know I keep on about this mask business, but Thailand numbers of uh, corona cases is really, really quite low. Now, it's not because we've uh, dodged a bullet because people haven't been coming here. Hundreds of people came in during the time of the spread. And, you know, certain pockets of the country have had a lot of infection, but it's not spread. And I am convinced it's down to this mask wearing. And I keep saying to you, if you're not wearing a mask when you're in public, please do. Uh, a particular interesting, funny uh, clip that I saw on television uh, the same day it inspired me to do um, our, our own test uh, of face masks. So, in the interest of science and uh, of interest of the world, Masks are very important in the COVID uh, pandemic. We've all got three different masks on here. This one was made by 3M. This one was bought at a local shop. This one was bought at a chemist. We want to blow the candle out. Matterform, would you like to blow the candle out? No, go nearer and blow it. <laughs> very good. Please, try to blow the candle out. <laughs> I'm going to try and blow the candle out. Oh no! Oh. Very good. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you've recently subscribed to this channel, I really appreciate you taking that step. Thank you, I really do appreciate it. If you've not subscribed, please hit the link below. Hit the bell, you'll be notified in your inbox of new published uh, videos. Always check the description below, you'll see more information and maybe some links to the locations I've taken the video. Also, please consider leaving me a, uh, a comment, anything. Just say hi, say what a lot of rubbish this video has been. Tell me how you're doing in your country or wherever you are in this isolation period. Consider giving me a thumbs up if you've liked this video. Till next time, stay safe, stay well, stay happy. See you. Bye bye. <laughs>